Most of the recent and significant developments in the now complex liquor control board scandal came to light this week in Dallas and exclusively right here on Channel 8. If you missed some of them, let's take a short review and look into some possibilities for next week. First of all, this man, James Colthorpe, owner and operator of the Debonair Dance Club of Dallas, told Channel 8 that in November he was approached by another club operator in Dallas and told that for $10,000 his troubles with the LCB would be over. That time Colthorpe had charges pending against him. Those charges still pending in Austin, by the way. Colthorpe then outlined what he called a protection racket headed in Dallas by this man, yet unidentified, but we know he is a Dallas private investigator. Colthorpe says that the investigator would send two LCB agents whom he controlled into a Dallas club on thumped up charges. Those charges being made, the investigator would come to the club owner saying, I can have these charges reduced or dropped, of course, for a certain sum of money. How could this be? Well, Colthorpe says it is because of this man's influence and connections with this man, William Ferguson, now retired assistant administrator for the Liquor Control Board. I talked with Mr. Ferguson today in his Austin home, and he told me that Colthorpe's charges against him are ridiculous, that he never knew of any protection racket, nor had he offered any favors to anyone, and that furthermore, Colthorpe's charges, according to Ferguson, were made because of a grudge he has against the LCB. Well, so much for these two charges, at least for the moment. Let's take a look now at what could happen next week. First of all, who is this man we've heard so much about? And is he the mastermind behind a protection racket? And who is this man who masterminded the leaflet that was passed out in Dallas and Austin, which subsequently led to the dismissal of six Dallas agents and now to the statewide probe? And are these two men one and the same? These two blanks will be filled in. 